Welcome to the Solar Sands MS Paint Variety Hour. I hope you guys are solar pilled today, because I sure am. I sure am doing great. Uh, new video is coming along. The next next video is coming along. It's about thirty minutes long, and all that. And now I've got a webcam. If you haven't noticed, I've got a webcam. Uh, so I figured it'd make these streams a little bit more entertaining. I have a new format so that I don't have to deal with Google and all that. Are you a solar solar pilled sand cell like me? So, oh. One day I'll get like the pen working on top of all this. But right now, right now this will have to do my mouse and keyboard. Oh yeah. So in order to not get copyright claimed and stuff like that, we're gonna do everything with this MS Paint. And I think that's like the format I wanna do where I just draw the stuff I talk about um and all that stuff is that an eyeball maybe hell yeah everybody's saying i have a face i've shown my face in like three videos now so you must not be a true solar sands fan if you're not if you're surprised at this You know, sorry I'm looking to the side so much. I've got my monitor. This is the most scuffed setup you'll ever see. Okay, here's my monitor. Here's my main monitor. Okay, nice and it's got a little stand, right? <clears throat> and it's, uh, there's a bunch of wires that go to this big, big cube. The big old cube that makes me do all my stuff. Uh, and it's on an ironing board, so it can go up and down. Like so. Problem is, my tablet, you know, is just this dinky little thing with a little stand here. Um, uh, ooh, we got a super chat from Oscar H. Hansen. Do a Riz face with your cool shades. Oh, of course. Hell yeah. Um, oh, also, can people hear me okay? It's not too quiet or anything, or too loud, maybe. Uh, yeah. Have I stopped making browsing DeviantArt? Yeah, basically. I <laughs> if, you, if you think I'm going to make browsing DeviantArt, you should probably unsubscribe. It's been, it's been about three years. It's very quiet. Damn. That's really, okay, hold on, hold on. I was in the middle of my story, and now, I'm just... and now I have to, uh... sounds like a disaster, hold on. Yeah, I could bring this closer, hold on, this is gonna be delicate, okay. It might even come into, into the, the screen, into my webcam, actually. Okay, how's that? I hope that's a bit better, you know? Okay, anyway, let's get back to my story. So my little tablet right here. Oop. My little tablet right here. So I have a... So I've done some reorganizing, actually. I've spent like a week reorganizing so I could get my life together. And... Basically, that means there's a table right here. Yeah, you see that? See that perspective? I'm an artist, guys. I I drew every day for like 10 years. And this is what it's brought me. Okay. So then... Try to put... Uh, why does it do that automatically? That's so irritating. 
Okay. Thank you. Thank you, kind viewer, for telling me to put live chat. Anyway, so my tablet, I'm just, I'm just putting it right here. <laughs> it's the bridge across the abyss. And I have all these wires that I have to go up and connect to it here. So it's a it's the most scuffed setup you'll ever see. All right, you you understand where I'm going? Yeah. So that's my that's my setup, and that's that's how it be. That's how it is. That's how it be. And if I oh, if I move slightly, even ever so slightly, then then my entire tablet could disconnect and ruin everything this is just great i'm planning on moving somewhere better <laughs> this is a metaphor for capitalism late stage capitalism that's what this is okay um so hold up the setup here we go guys it's like the a team so this is there's like a little pen so that so this is the setup to illustrate it to you guys. Hell yeah. How's the audio now? Better? A little bit louder? A little bit See now you can see me drink. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that insane? Yeah, the tablet is seeing death. It can drop at any moment. It's insane. Okay. Bada bing, bada boom. Hold on. I want to see if this is watery. Oh, ah, uh, ha, 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 ha. Solar sands on a Friday afternoon. Hello, Brandon Buckingham. I've watched some of your interviews. They're very interesting. If if uh, if anybody doesn't know, I I was a uh, I visited Brandon Buckingham and Emperor Lemon a few weeks ago in person. Actually, in real life, I, I touched grass, and so so I'm really moving up in the world. I would say. You know, I I would say I, I'm I'm really getting somewhere in life. Uh, so that was interesting, certainly. He uh, tried touching the sky. How about that? Yeah, emp. <laughs> uh, the empire of lemon to be replaced by republic. That's correct. Brandon, Brandon Buckingham. Mr. Do I follow... If, you follow, if I follow you on Twitter, you should... Uh, I forgot to ask. You should send me your Discord. Because I've got a feeling that... Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Next topic. Here we go. Next topic of the day. Oh, the disco ball? That's that's actually a giant ball of bottle caps that I hot glued together when I was like ten. I still have it. Um, every time I seen your face, you look old. Yeah, probably because I haven't shaved very well. I've been very lazy recently. Uh, hold on, hold on. We can do this better. We're artists. Come on. Yes. Yes. So the so the bird app has been has been <laughs> the bird of division. I like that. That's a that's a good uh 
That's a good nickname. The Bird of Div Division has been causing some problems, some of which I will be talking about in the next video. Um, Elon has taken over, and it's a bit of a mess. I don't, I can't really say whether it's any better or any worse than it was before he took over. It's just confusing, and things change a lot. So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that every every one of my mutuals I have is I'm I feel I feel like just Twitter could go down at any moment. So I'm trying to like secure every you know connection I've made on Discord or some or by some other means so that I don't have to sit there and lose everything when Elon finally destroys the place forever or something. So the bird of division. Once again, I, I, people are uh, t people get on get on my my case about random bullshit, and uh, <laughs> but I, I part of me likes it. Part of me likes the fight, and that's not gonna. You know, just just when I was out, they reel me back in. You know that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, that's happening. A lot of a lot of artists are really upset about AI on on Twitter, and and things are getting a little bit ridiculous because because uh, there will be certainly some of you have probably seen. Uh, you know, okay. Here's you know here's. Hold on. This might this might take a little bit, but she'll but it'll be worth it, trust me. It'll be worth it. Okay. Something like this, right? Oh no, hold on. Okay. So you have basically the Mona Lisa. <laughs> uh, and she's like this. Right. And uh, she's chilling. She's being chilling. Come on, let's make this smaller. We need some higher, some visual hierarchy here. Anyway, so she's being chilling. Uh, and and then some guy, some guy named like, yo, I'm Chase. I'm the AI AI mastermind, collaborating with AI people all over the world. They'll show like a picture. Right, and like, hold on, there's like some mountains here and a little path. I'm like, I'm the AI guy. It's, uh, I'm gonna expand this piece. And then they like add, and then the AI like, you know, adds a bunch of stuff and extends everything. She's got like... She's got like some fishing trousers. Hell yeah. She's fishing. <laughs> um Yeah, and it and basically expands everything. There's some clouds. And it's like this is the future of art. You know, they they do that kind of thing. And then I have to sit there like, well, okay, it's content aware fill, but bigger, I guess, and more advanced. And then, <laughs> and then, and then people go on the internet and are like, "You don't understand. An artist's job is to keep is to to remove everything that's unnecessary until the most simple stuff is there. 
you are destroying art. You don't understand art. And it's like, guys, calm down. Oh my God. I know it's AI, but it's, it's just, it's really not that deep. He's just showing like what this is. And I get they're annoying and I get AI people are very annoying douchebags all the time, but, but like, this is ridiculous. Y'all need to chill out, okay? You y'all need to chill out. You're 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 making that you you're just making yourselves look absolutely insane. All right. <laughs> so yeah, that's the that topic, that topic, and that's my thought about that. Yeah. Like I get, I get how you could see it as offensive, but I really don't think it's that deep, bruh. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Ooh. Set the secondary color to black makes your background and eraser black. Huh? What do you mean secondary? Oh. Hold on. How does it make my eraser black? Whoa. Oh, what the? Oh. Ah. Huh. I don't know if I like that. I need to see my eraser. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. What else, folks? I'm a dark mode type of guy. Yeah, Reese, for the past few years. Draw Obama. Hmm. Obama? Have you seen those uh, Donald Trump Obama AI um, a video game? Like, they they're like, look like playing a video game. Those are pretty funny. Those are hilarious. Well, I guess if you bought recently, I bought the uh, Rivendell Lego uh, Lord of the Rings because uh, I, it's really expensive, but I figured they're not going to make something like that ever again. <laughs> Favorite Boards Canada track? Oh, man, that's... I mean, happy cycling is pretty, pretty good, but I feel like that's a normie answer. Riverdale Lego? Hell no. Hell no. What are you, what is this nonsense, huh? What are you trying to do to me, huh? Trying to, trying to make a fool of me? What is this? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Indeed. Obama. Obama. I'm. More, I think I'm more of a Bill Clinton kind of guy. You feel me? Hillary. Hillary, please. You gotta tell Monica. Hillary, please. You gotta, you gotta tell Monica Lewinsky. I didn't mean it. Hillary. Hillary, hold on. That's... Hillary, please. Okay. Obama. Uh. Okay. You know what's been pretty funny recently? <laughs> oh. Next AI video is in the work, yes. 
Uh, please. Okay. Um, other thing. So the... I've become really, really fascinated with the... Uh, hold on. Let me type this out. The Breaking Bad Every Frame Twitter account, which posts uh, five frames of Breaking Bad every 30 minutes. And, uh, and recently they got to the, the, the most famous frame of all time. I think, I think you know the one. Hold on. He needs to be more round. Ah, this isn't Photoshop. I can't expand the eraser. Hold up. Oh, please. Please. There we go. Ah, oh, I need to get this and cut this in half. Hold on. <laughs> Walter. Walter. I don't know, Walter. Walt, you're acting kind of sus lately. Anyway, so this is the frame. I think we all, we can all recognize it. And they finally got to this frame, and it got like 500,000 likes. <laughs> 500,000 likes for the for the frame. So I'm watching like the rest of it, and it's get so it's getting close to the end. I think it actually ends in June, because we're getting to the finale. Uh. So that was pretty amazing. I was actually, hold on. I was actually uh, on, twi on Twitter, patiently waiting to get to this frame for like a good two hours, which is crazy. You know, you know what else is happening? Oppenheimer. How do I, how do I, hold on. Uh, yes. Oppen, Oppenheimer like I did to my daughter. I'm, okay. Yeah, Oppenheimer. Or the Barbie movie. How do I, how do I represent Barbie quickly? Yeah. Yes, that's it, I think. It's got like a ponytail, I think. <sighs> Oppenheimer or Barbie? I mean, I'd, I'd hope so for both. I'd hope for both, right? Unless Oppen oh, Oppenheimer is like six hours long. Am I Ken? I don't know, you tell me. Ba bum ba bum ba bum ba bum ba. Okay, we're losing viewers. <laughs> See, this is the problem. I gotta come up with a way to be entertaining. Probably posting actual videos would be helpful, but I'm waiting, waiting on a sponsor. Then I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know? Walt. Uh let's let the quirky side out. That's what I'm saying, man. That's what I'm saying. Next Gartic phone stream. Um, I have to gather more people to do it. It uh it didn't didn't really 
I mean, it was fun when we had it, but the heydays of Solar Sands, you know, like, I'm starting to slowly realize that I'm getting into a stable point in my channel, which means there isn't as much drama or or a lot of people going on. I, a lot of the connections I made in the early days was were are are basically disintegrated now because a lot of them turned out to be you know bad people but other than that you know i have a few more connections but it's it's not the same the days of 20 2017 to 20 2020 are are basically over uh you know which which sucks but we're entering a new mature period of YouTube, I suppose. Yeah, the excite it was, you know, like, like when I begun this channel all the way back in 26, 2015, mostly 2016, because I started in December of 2015. Man, it was so much fun being on YouTube back then. It was so much, there was like so much, like every single day something was happening. And it was crazy, but now that those days are kind of over. And I think we have to accept the fact that, that it's kind of, that, that all the, all that, all that excitement is basically gone. Like, you know, iDubs recently, hold on. This doesn't really look like him. Now that looks a little bit more like him. I dubs recently uh basically apologized for all of his content of the old days. Which I think is a bit extreme, but that's a whole, you know, that's a whole discourse. I, I already made my thoughts about it in like a tweet, and that was basically it. But yeah, that's basically it. That really solidified to me just how, like, gone those days are. <laughs> uh, where, like, this ki that kind of uh, drama just... That kind of drama just isn't... Uh, isn't around anymore people are like like we're we're in the it's like when it's like when a company is starting and it's like oh we're all young we're all hip let's do stuff and now and now they've they've sold the company and and everybody's you know trying to be more businessman like and more respectful they got families and stuff to take care of so now now, like, the edginess is gone, and everybody's, I miss it. There was, a, like, a, like, of course it was full of horrible shit. <laughs> of course there was disasters, and it was mostly bad. Like, I, I will, I will guarantee, I will, I will give you that plenty of times. <laughs> the past is mostly bad, as is everything else. But now it's it's uh it's just a different kind of bad uh, where it's not as fun in my opinion but that's that's what it is now <laughs> life is so boring what do i do motherfuckers when i introduce them to the world of drug trafficking <laughs> yeah like even PewDiePie, my man just won at life, didn't he? He went to Japan. Alright, see ya. He went to Japan, and with his, you know, wife. Doesn't he? Did his wife get pregnant? Did I hallucinate that? Whatever. So now he's, uh, he's, uh. He's basically just going to live out the rest of his days in a very peaceful existence, basically. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, what's so like what even is the big events people like creator clash i suppose the great edginess of 2015 to 2020 yeah pewdiepie got pregnant that makes sense But it feels like every single YouTuber I subscri subscribe to back in the day just isn't posting anymore. You know? Like maybe that's because our our clocks are just synchronized in some strange way. Okay, let's talk about Ooh, let's move on. That solar sands is a bloody spy. TF2, baby. What are my thoughts on Lego Power Miners? Uh, t -t 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 -t. Lego Power Miners was very fun when I got it. It was the, I remember those very bright green, lime green c bricks. I got a few of those sets actually in the first wave. In the first wave, I got most of those sets. Um, but after that, it was after after that I didn't really get into it that much more. I think they retired it after a few other waves, and that was it. I was like, that was a cool. But I think I'm good after like six sets, six or five, five or six sets. Lego collection video? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, but mine isn't isn't as big enough to be impressive, but it's not it's, it's not small enough to really be. I don't know. not it's not uh it's just just i don't know if there was anything interesting i could come out of it i'd have to do more scripted videos and stuff like that jesse jesse we need to cook jesse 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 we need to cook Oh, I'm bald, Jesse. Please. That's the math right there. Hold on. My baby blue. Okay. Uh, yo, 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 Mr. White. It's crazy how much Breaking Bad is still a meme. Ooh, we got a super chat from Luke Pixel. Hey, love your videos. A lot of them... Leave me thinking shower thoughts, lol. Keep up the work, you're killing it. Thank you. I hope to make everybody think of me in the shower. Uh, hold on. That's not Walter, that's a Wallace and Gromit character. Ah, that's true. This is 99.7% pure Lego. Oh my god. That's crazy. Yeah, I'm making a next, the next AI-related video, and I feel like people are going to get upset with me because of it. Do your videos ever give you a major existential crisis? Maybe when I first think about them, but after that, you know, you get so used to it that you're just thinking about finishing a video. <laughs> The stream reminds me of Technoblade's chill streams. Damn, Technoblade. Bruh. My brothers, my little brothers were like, Technoblade isn't dead. He's just faking it. He's doing it for attention or something like that. I'm like, bro, what, what are you on about? <laughs> this would be such a hard thing to fake for no reason. Oh, man. 
you know who this is? It's Monopoly Man. He's gone from us now. Rest in peace. You have the audacity to eat another type of chip? How dare you? Hell yeah. I've been uh I've been watching Game of Thrones recently. That's pretty cool. I like Game of Thrones. I don't think it's as good as Lord of the Rings, but it is very up there. I like all the political scheming and that stuff. It's very good, but I'm going to stop at season four or five. In the past, you were practicing your fundamentals in art. Are you still interested in pursuing the goal of being an artist? Um, see, I always conceptualize being an artist as a means to an end. I, I, like, a few years ago, I met, well, before AI art came out, I, I had, like, this, you know, this, this romantic notion of, like, ah, yes, painting and all that. I'll be a cool artist, painter, blah, blah, blah. But now I'm starting to realize that uh the quality of just communing communicating your ideas is going to be what really matters in the end at this point so i want to use i want i still practice sometimes it's gotten it's gotten pretty bad i've gotten i've got uh i have gotten really demotivated you know I used to draw every day, now I don't. Um, and I got to a point where I wasn't improving very much anymore. I was just kind of doing the same thing over and over again. I'm like pretty, I'm like in my school, I could basically outdraw anyone else. But I wasn't good enough to be, you know, like internet amazing renderer. And I don't think I ever will. I don't I don't have that energy or the discipline. So I'm going to cultivate my drawing skills to as much as I can realistically. And then I'll just send sketches over to people who can render render things better. Here's Mike with a one thingy. I don't know what that is. A pound. He's got a cool profile. <laughs> so I view I view art as more of a means to an end for my purposes. And I'm pretty good at writing. So I just want to illustrate what I'm writing and stuff like that. Uh, and I'll just hire a small army of artists to do the projects I, I want to do. A Euro? Okay. That's good to know. Rating art from viewers live? Mm, maybe. I don't know. See, the reason I stopped, like, one of the reasons I stopped browsing DeviantArt and all the other stuff is it, it, it just got too repetitive. Uh, after a certain point, I was realizing I was just saying the same thing over and over again. Because a lot of people's art, you know, at a certain level, they're just, it's just the same common mistakes and stuff over and over again. So... I figured I it was time to move on to other stuff and to talk about other kinds of art. <laughs> um, and I think that was a, a really good decision because my channel got a lot better and I was enjoying things a little bit more. Possessed me to go live today. Uh, I wanted to test out the webcam and and I'm just waiting for my next video to get approved by something. Thanks for all the encouragement on being demotivated in art, but I think my 
demotivate my demotivation isn't exactly because I don't have isn't exactly like me me being like depressed or something it I think it's me just seeing the writing on the wall <laughs> like things are 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 changing and I feel like my demotivation is is a very rational feeling uh and it, it just seems like I'd be putting in a lot of effort into something that won't be worth it in a in the end what are your opinions on Jojo's Bizarre Adventure by Mike? Two euros. Unfortunately, I haven't seen it. Um, I don't. I don't really watch. I haven't gotten into that thing. I I get recommended it all the time, but uh, I just haven't seen it. But yeah, my my demotivation is basically I should probably invest in a different skill and just use art and drawing as a way to do something else. It's, yeah. Like AI art is is going to change the landscape no matter no matter if people protest against it or not, it's uh, it's quite pervasive and like I, I don't really see how <laughs> you know people are going to like be professional artists for for like simple things anymore just like simple illustrations i think you're you'd have to like really become a much more complex uh problem solver rather than just rendering and and drawing and all that what am i drawing i don't know these are like three three heads stacked on top of each other one of them is like mischievous one of them is happy one of them is distraught Fiverr already put bad artists out of work. I don't really think it's about being bad or skill level, really. Uh, it's about what we prioritize as human beings. Because if I can draw this, you know, this silly idea and get it to be and just put it into image to image and get something you know amazing basically exactly what i wanted then th then there's no point in doing this step there's no point in doing this step and learning how to do that step manually um you'd have to focus on like on this step on on the quality of your idea and the outline of it but even then, I'm like, man. <laughs> even then, I'm like, man, how long until that goes away, too? And it's just like, read my mind, computer. Bleep, 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 bleep. Got it. Ding. Here it is. This is so like I touch upon I, I sort of touch upon this in the video. I'm kind of annoyed because I'm ex I feel like I'm explaining it a little bit better here, but not but I'm just like, ugh. whatever I'll pro in the next video I'll probably t be talking about the last topic and then I'll stop the series because I'm so sick of of talking about AI F already but like AI people saying AI art isn't art I, I, I just I feel like that's such a useless thing to argue about like it doesn't even matter <laughs> if it's if it's not real art or if it doesn't have human soul like if i if i show you ai art 
and don't tell you it's AI art, and you're like, wow, this piece is so amazing. Look at the human touch. And then I reveal it's it's actually an AI. And you're like, oh, well, then it's soulless. I'm like, what's the point? Like, what? How how good is the consistency of your principle? If it can't be, uh, if it can't handle the tiniest bit of scrutiny like that. The AI alignment problem. Maybe. At the end of all this, I plan on doing a video that talks about computers in general. But that's a long way down the road. I have all these thoughts and ideas. All these thoughts and ideas. <laughs> I, de I definitely sound depressed. Yeah, um... You know, I, I've been, it's been hard to enjoy anything I, I used to like. Uh, I feel more and more tired as the days go on. I'm like, and I, I'm starting to think like, man, I think I might be a little bit depressed. Shit, that's not good. That's not very good for my productivity. See, this is the problem. I can't see the eraser. Okay, let's talk about something else. Solar Sands tech tips. Solar Sands. Hold Solar Sands tech tips. Remember, everybody, everything is TV. It doesn't matter how much you talk. No one's going to understand you. Beep, bleep, bleep, bleep. Here we go on the MS Paint Variety Hour. Da 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 Ah, it's not supposed to be funny. Oh, shit. How about a joke, Murray? Haha. -ha. I'm going to... I'm going to kill you. Wow. Not, so, not a very good joke, is it? That's not funny, Joker. Everybody knows. Everybody knows TikToks ain't funny, Joker. You have to put in a real eye funny meme or something. You have to put in, where's the Twitter memes? Where's the Reddit memes? TikTok isn't funny. I'm Robert De Niro, TikTok isn't funny. Hold on. Now, how can, how can anybody find that funny? I mean, seriously, how can anybody find that funny? Joker, Joker, please, please, we're just trying to have a kid-friendly show right here, Joker. Does he have hair? I think he has hair, yeah. No, Murray, <laughs> I'm gonna, <laughs> um, this has gone off the rails, hasn't it? Uh, oh shit, here we go, sec 200, no, no, Tar Taurus. Ah, hi, Solar. A couple of months ago, I attended Christopher, Christopher Zetterfan's newest ex exhibition. Oh, that's cool. Forget me not. He visited my school and I... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. I'm, I'm losing it. I'm losing it. I got the pleasure of discussing his and my own art with him. In honor, draw some Christopher art. Uh, his art is really complicated. I can't do it in MS Paint. Hmm. <laughs> Solar Sands has been on a downward spiral recently, and now I think he's lost it completely. <laughs> downward spiral, downward spiral. I need a, I need a big meme like that. You guys notice? All I do is steal other people's shit. 
for memes. I need I need a big meme. He gave you 200 sex? What? What the? I thought this was a family friendly stream. You can't give me 200 sex. That's crazy. Sunny V2, the downfall of Solar Seeds. Dark Souls 3 playthrough. I'm doing. I, uh. I, I'm I'm finishing Dark Souls one again. I'm already at the Four Kings, so I'll probably move on to Dark Souls two. And if that gets way too frustrating, I'll move on to Dark Souls three. I think. Somebody somebody take this and 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 put it through an AI image to image and show me what you get. Show me how the computer is actually supposed to do it. <laughs> make a PNG of Solar Sands, fall down a 3D rendered pit, and make him spin around. You know what would be funny? I was thinking I could host some sort of, like, YTP competition. But it would all be, like, stuff from my videos. And I think it'd work because a lot of my videos are pretty serious nowadays. But I also have a wide variety of things I say. So I feel like a YTP contest where like everybody puts in a one minute video or something would be pretty funny. But I don't even know if people know what a YouTube poop is anymore. Just like an edit competition, you know? Rugs. What on earth was that in the chat? Shush grugs. What kind of an emote is that? Sus. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Lots of sus, I bet. Um, do I know what a homestuck is? Man, bro, you guys still make me feel like i'm in 20 2016 sometimes everybody's still recommending me jojo's bizarre adventure and homestuck bruh when it when are you guys gonna move on to do stuff i never want i never got into homestuck i don't care i don't it looks it looks really really silly every character looks like this i can't deal with that i can't take that seriously jojo's bizarre adventure i might sometimes ever watch the problem is if it's too long and there's like too much to to deal with you know then then i'm not gonna like every every JoJo character looks like this. <laughs> okay, have you? <laughs> I can't. I can't take this seriously. It's it's so hard. Another internet aesthetic video like the one you did about liminal spaces, maybe. But liminal spaces actually like at one point had a good specific definition, and every other internet aesthetic is just like. Oh, this is, this is like dream cottage core. And it's like a picture of a cottage and it has like sparkles on it. I'm like, I, that's not really. Oh, the lips. Yeah, you're right. So like, I can't, I can't make a video on, on like dream cottage core without there actually being like something beyond just a few internet photos that someone edited. Bardcore. <laughs> Foodie gear arrow, ergo, arrow. I might, I, uh, there's a problem. Like these videos take so long to make now. If I choose, if I choose, if I choose to make something on Food Gear Ergo or Arrow, I it end up being a thirty minute video and it takes like three months to make. I'm so sick of doing that. Unless I made something like ten minutes.
like a nine minute video that's just like this is kind of neat i could do that i could make a few more of those i could make a few more of those and did and if they got and that's another thing if they if they don't pass a certain view threshold then like i'm i'm sorry to say that it's 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 gonna be hard to justify me putting that much time into it unfortunately but you know not everything i do is based on views so maybe maybe but i feel like food gear ergo has already been talked about a, a lot as well i don't know what if if i could add anything new to it Anyway, so this is what every JoJo's Bizarre Adventure character looks like. Oh, it's behind the chat. Takamuna. Takamuna. Hopefully that's how you say it. That's awesome. You should restore old paintings. Hmm. I feel like that requires some training that I don't have. I haven't even checked the auto audio. Hold on. Ah. Wow. If it's if it's not real art or if the that's the movie soul. Like if I if I show you I like this. I think I'm liking this format so far where I just use MS Paint. Food gear er arrow. Hmm. Believe me, I already have plenty of video ideas. Sort of. Sort of. I have like video ideas, but I'm like, is this worth it to make a video on? Oh, I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Ooh. I am for real. Yeah. Also, you know, I need to like make friends in the real life and all that. Can you draw your request? I'm sorry. I haven't seen your chat. I didn't see it unfortunately so so i don't know what you asked me to draw show me what you got i'm obsessed with drawing faces today star of goofy fellas oh my there you go oh oh Oh, oh, open Gangnam style. Hey, sexy lady. Draw Miss Jackson. I don't know what Miss Jackson looks like. I wouldn't want to accidentally draw someone I I didn't mean to draw. It's a cow. It's getting sucked up. Uh, I'd buy this NFT. Hell yeah. Can you draw this? And, and it's just it's just a freaking carrot emoji, eyeball emoji, and then a fist, and then an eyeball, and then yawning, and then. Uh, giggling and then dead and then dead emoji uh tombstone what why why would i draw that you've already made it in picture form why would I, why would i draw something that why, why would 
you've already made it in picture form. Why would I draw that again? This is a non-fungible token, everybody. Don't look at it without my permission. Ooh, a shape tier list. That's a good idea. Shape tier list. Okay, you guys are gonna have to remind me how the categories work. So like, okay, hold on. Okay, you're about to see some MS Paint maximalism right here. I also feel like streaming is a big thing nowadays. People need a lot of content. S A B C D E F. That's right. That's right. That's right. Uh, yeah. Hell yeah. Do -do 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 how am I going to do this? So green is S tier, obviously. That's what I'm thinking. S, A, B, wait, 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 hold on. S, A, B, C, D, E, F. That's seven categories. <laughs> what do I, what do I think of solar core? You, you know what would be hilarious if everybody in this live stream like went to aesthetics wiki, typed in solar core, put in like some solar panels and all that, and like made this a thing. Cause that would be very funny. And I think if people made an actual thing, we would we could make infinite videos basically, you know? <laughs> okay. So hold on. Okay, here's S, S tier. A, B, C, damn, we don't have enough room. D, and that's paint variety hour. I can't, we can't cover up. what we've already made, okay? Let's just make, let's just make this F, okay? Let's just make this F, because that's how it usually goes in the grading system, right? All right, hold on, hold on. That's not exactly, that doesn't really look like a different color. Here we go. All right. This is our pastel colored tier list. Like e like putting an e seems redundant. Okay. Okay. Now Okay, let's start with the line, right? Line Okay, what wait, what color should they be? Something that contrasts nice with all of these. Probably bright, deep bright red or orange. Solar sands. Sue orange. Yeah, that shows up pretty well. Immune. Try 55. I will try 55. Draw my avatar. If not, enjoy the monies. I'll see if I can get to it. It looks like uh, the Doom mask. MF Doom mask with like a person behind it. Solar core. I found out what solar core actually is. Oh, it already exists. Huh. Let's make this a little bit more. More yellow. Can we add some yellow into there? 
looking at. There we go. There we go. There we go. Nice and saturated. Okay, so a line, I feel like, like, okay, line, you, you use it in everything. Oh, that doesn't contrast with that pretty very well. Hold on. Go a little darker. Uh, that works. Okay, so a line. Hi, hi, hi. Maybe, maybe we should just go with with black. Yeah, yeah. So line is basically. It it makes up all the other shapes, right? So I'm going to I'm going to say that's a solid B if it makes up everything else. But it it's not like that special is it's just like, you know, exactly what you need. Curved line basically the same thing. It's uh you know. It's going to it it makes up a lot of stuff. It makes up a lot of stuff. A tier A tier Hmm. Yeah, maybe you're, maybe you're right. Since it, we stand on the shoulders of giants, you know. So, a line and curved line, probably. Uh, circle. I feel like putting circle in S tier because. Basically, circle is in every single piece of techno, nearly every single piece of technology we have. It has infinite, infinite points. Try, try 55, uh, immune it says put star of David on S. Maybe <laughs> we'll, we'll have to see. Yeah, but I feel like circle is, is solid, easy S. Square, square. Square is also everywhere, but I feel like at this point it's cliche and kind of it's too stable. It's a little bit too stable. I would. Mm. It's either A or B tier. I'm going to put it in A because it's basically like a building block, sort of. Let's go. Where is there? <laughs> where? Where is everybody? <laughs> Bad tier list. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? This is a perfect tier list. That is a rectangle, not a square. You're right. Square A. Rectangle S. Because I feel like there's more rectangles everywhere than there are actual like squares. No, this tier list is objectively correct. I don't know what you guys are talking about. Wrangle. Okay, let's move on. Ooh, <laughs> rectangle with radius edge. Hmm. You know, guys. I feel like like square with radius is a B tier. It's too. It's too. Hold on. That's. It's too. It's just. It just doesn't have that that punch, you know, that oomph. Rectangle with radius, however, is like a little bit more respectable because it's the shape of an iPhone. And I feel like that just, it just makes more sense that way. You know, I'm going off vibes with the radius ones. All right, what the hell is this thing? Oh, what the? Oh, so this is like a shape builder. Polygon. Oh, a polygon. Just all polygons. Hmm. I don't know. Polygons give me pain. Nah, nah. Not good. Just see. Just see. It's like we use it a lot, but it doesn't have any master. Yeah. It's too weird. Too weird. I don't like it. It it needs to be like stamped into shape. Triangle S tier easily. Pyramids. Uh, it's very stable. 
it's a very stable shape. Equilateral triangle, by the way. Right angle triangle, mm, honestly, not that not that big of a fan. Honestly, not that big of a fan. I feel like I it's either C or B because just I mean just look at it. It's I mean, I it should be, you know, it is a triangle. It's an honorary triangle, but it's not a Bill Cipher triangle. So so let's put B. Triangle S tier. Extreme triangle enthusiast. Thank you, Nova Miota. We are. Right angle kind of mid. Yeah. What the hell is this thing? Look at this thing. Diamond. First of all, this is not... They call it diamond, but this is not what diamonds look like. Okay? When they cut diamonds, this is not at all what they look like. I don't get it. Overrated C tier. Overrated. Isosceles triangles. To be honest, I I don't know what the difference is. Immune is donated again and says hi Ibuki. Man, immune's immune's the chat of the stream today. Yeah, it's just a tilted square. Overrated. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hold on, let me let me do a better one. Overrated. It's just this, but but turn ninety degrees or forty five degrees. I don't know. This. Hmm. I feel ugh, ugh. I don't even know what to do with this. I don't even know what to do with this. Like it's too. Like what? What on earth would I use this for? What on earth would I use that for? D. Hexagon, easy S tier. Easy S tier. They're in B kit. They're in beehives. They're symmetrical. They're cool. You know, I mean, it's. Am, am I. Are we in agreement? Are we in agreement here? <laughs> yeah, hexagons are, are extremely useful. Okay, arrow pointing, arrow pointing to the right. Um, I'm going B tier because I feel like that's just where most arrows point, you know? Maybe I'm just my right, right side of brain speaking. Arrow pointing to the left. Yeah, not as, not as special, I don't think. I don't think it's... <laughs> I don't think it's it's not the same. It's not the same. Uh, you know, it's not the same. What are you what are you going to do, huh? What are you going to do? Stop. <laughs> okay, arrow pointing up. A easy A. Come on. You need to look up then you use this arrow. Immune says Solan, I'm off to bed. May Allah give you strength and happiness in life. Mashallah. Thank you, Immune again. Very cool. I hope Allah does. Take out the hexagon. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Okay, arrow pointing down. Again, funny, but reminds me of like, like an arrow you see on a mine. All right, all right. What the hell is this thing? Look at this thing. Ugh. Ugh. What the hell is this? It's like a it's like a four fight four sided star. It's like trying to be a star, but it doesn't it it's just failing. It's just failing. It doesn't it doesn't know what it's it has a it has no it looks like a a, a weird like blade at the end of of a blender. Hell no, that's F tier. That's F tier. It's so, it's so, it's so, so weird, so strange. It's like an alien. It's like, a, yeah, another star. It's strange. Star, easy A tier, but 
I'm d docking a little bit because I feel like it's over, like it's used way too much. It's used way too much. All right, all right. Six-sided star. Is that six? Yeah, six-sided star. Jewish, kind of cool, kind of neat. People should use this as a star more than this star, in my opinion. But it's still a little bit strange. So I'm just going to put it right next to this star, I think. It's cool, but like, how often are you going to use it for other things? Especially because it has a lot of connotations. Speech bubble. Speech bubble... Uh, kind of goaded, honestly. Kind of S. But it's not as fundamental. So I'm going to put it there alongside the rectangle. Speech bubbles are useful. Immune says, this is for the viewers. May each and every one of you experience happiness, remember to love one another, and happy Pride Month. Happy Pride Month. Thank you, Immune. Oh, also happy Shame Month as well. Without speech bubbles, comics won't work. Yeah. Oh, 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 hold on, hold on. We've got a few. We've got a few. Let's not get carried away. Regular speech bubble with radius sides good speech bubble with rounded sides honestly that's way more aesthetic i'm putting in an s tier way way more aesthetic goodbye immune circle speech bu bubble is better i and it's fundamental thought bubble honestly b I'm leaning towards B. It's too, maybe even C. It's just too complicated. It's it's not elegant. It's barely a shape. It's more like a like a visual moniker at that point. Okay, okay. Here we go. Heart. Honestly, ugh, I'm thinking C. Way too overused. Valentine's Day. People need to come up with a new symbol for love. It's it looks like a butt cheek and then like a point. I'm putting out a solid C tier. Also because I hate love. <laughs> Lightning bolt. Hmm. I'm think I'm thinking what are we thinking, chat? <laughs> That's pretty cool. Okay, lightning bolt. It's a little bit it's it's a little bit quirky, but it's also pretty cool. I'm thinking oh, what should we do? What should we do? Lightning S tier, maybe. Lightning Bolt is A tier. <laughs> oh, man. It's not used often, but you know it's cool. Yeah, Lightning McQueen. Lightning McQueen, baby. Shazam. Shazam. Kachow. That's that's solid S tier. That's solid S tier. It's just too cool. It's just too cool. Okay, that's I think that's all the shapes. That's all the shapes. Nice. All the MS Paint shapes ranked, baby. Hell yeah. I think I'm I think I'm I'm good with this. I I might ch I might looking at it looking at at it as a whole and now i'm thinking i don't know i'm thinking i might move some things like if i would do this again but but I, i'm thinking it's a good tier list all right <laughs> it's it's got everything uh speech bubble should be f What's wrong with you, huh? What's wrong with you? Yeah. Four prong star too low. Four prong star looks weird, man. I've never seen it used in like anything else except like, I don't know, like the blade of something. It's too strange. It's too strange. The oval? Oh shit, you're right. Oval. Honestly, o B 
ovals are B. They don't have the utility of the speech bubble. But they're they're pretty decent. They're pretty decent. The, the circle just... When you go from an oval to a circle, it's like oval is like slightly perfect. Circle is like absolute perfection. You know? Can I play Kahoot? I don't know. I'm thinking about... <laughs> I don't know. I don't. We don't have a trapezoid. There's no trapezoid on here. Oh, there's no trapezoid. If MS Paint needs to put in an update where they put in more shapes, they should do that. They should do that. You know? You know? <sighs> All right. I'm getting tired. Cloud speech bubble is better than a regular one. Are you out of your mind? Cloud is just too complicated. It's there's too much there's too much detail to it. It it gets lost, in my opinion. It it, it insists upon itself. There ain't no trapezoids in the MS Paint, you know. Uh, yeah, less space for actual words. Exactly. Exactly. No octagon. There's a lot of stuff missing. Maybe we can do an actual shapes. Like if there's some sort of shape website, then uh, then you can link it in the chat. I don't even know. <laughs> Blood. Blood's trying too hard, man. All right. <laughs> tier maker probably has a shape tier list. Of course they would. Do you think we're the first? Do you think we're? I doubt we're the first. It feels like people have ranked every single shape, no, every single thing known to man on tier list. Tier maker as a Lego set tier list, probably, but there's just too too many Lego sets. You'd have to like make it like Star Wars Lego sets, and even then, you'd have to make it so that it's between like 2010 to 2020, because that's like hundreds and hundreds of Lego sets just within that. You know, feet feet tier list. Oh. Solar, the type of guy to be tired in the mid afternoon. Yep, that's how it be. Wikipedia list of officially recognized shapes. That sounds like an interesting article. No way, star is an F. Only the four pointed star. The regular, the star of David, and the five pointed star. The six pointed star and the five pointed star are. In a in solid A tier territory, I would say. <laughs> solar Solar's toes tier list. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. I think uh, I think this has come to its natural conclusion. Solar Sands videos tier list. That'd be neat. I wouldn't make that though because uh, that that'd just be too too much work for me to to cut out all the thumbnails and do that unless someone else wants to do it. Where would you place Boba and Kiki? Oh, that's I don't even know what they look like. Boba and Kiki are meant for each other. It'd be a crime to separate them on a tier list. Aesthetic tier list. I don't know. I don't know. This is just funny because it's because it's on MS Paint. <laughs> okay. Well, we've done an hour and thirty minutes. I think that's the amount of time I want to spend on these things because it's basically like, you know, like I don't want to 
blow through all the material I have for the MS Paint Variety Hour. This is ep- episode one, baby. The premiere of the of the MS Paint Variety Hour. Uh, we we've we've made a lot of progress. I think we did. We talked about a lot. Stay tuned for the next video and maybe another episode of this. I'll probably bring a guest or something. The twenty the twenty four hour stream. Please, just a little bit of ASMR, I beg. Thanks everyone for joining. I think that concludes this live stream. Thanks for all the donations as well. To this silliness. To this utter silliness. The spray spray paint tool is top tier. Hmm. Yes, we'll have to rank the two of the tools next time. <laughs> you put that in S. All right, fellas. All right. Save that beauty, and let's end this for now. Thanks, everybody. See ya.